department responded to this location on a shooting. Uh, we have three people that were pronounced at the scene here. I'm not going to go into verifying names. I know that there are some reports that are out there, uh, but per official department policy and working in conjunction with the coroner's office, I'm going to respect that that information and verification needs to come from the coroner's office. But like I said, we have three people that were pronounced dead at the scene here. We have one uh, child that was transported to a local hospital, is still in extremely critical condition at this point in time. Uh, we're continuing to work through the investigation. I don't have a lot that I can give you or verify of information that you have out there because we still need to complete the investigation. The detectives have been in here for a couple hours processing the scene. Uh, the Office of Medical Examiner just showed up. They're going to start doing what they need to do. Part of uh, our investigation still kind of relies a little bit more on uh, that, so I don't want to get into any details. Uh, it's a horrific scene. Uh, my heart goes out to the family and friends of anybody involved, the neighbors or anybody that's affected by this uh, deal. Unfortunately, I can't go into a lot of information until until we get confirmation from the coroner's office and such. I don't have the ages and genders at this time. I can tell you they're definitely three kids under the age of you know 10. I don't want to go and be misquoted on what they are. We do have one adult female that's inside too. Are you looking for any suspects, Commander? This time uh, we we're not looking for any suspects. We're have you been called to this location before? Has the police been called on domestic violence? I have not been told that we have. So I'd I'd have to have dispatch do a search on that, but. I don't have any indication that we had. Commander Sonia, would you be able to tell us that this is a murder-suicide? No, I'm not at this point in time not able to confirm or deny at this time. Uh, there's still some... Uh, we don't go into talking about evidence at the scene. So, I, like I said, uh, if we're a little further in the investigation, I'll be happy to, to talk a little bit more, but we have some questions that we still need to answer, and I don't want to be pinned down on something to find out that there's several things that we still need to look into to really make that final determination. And the father said behind one one a car screeching, you know, screeching off the amount of time the shootings. Are you, are you looking at that? Uh, if we, if those neighbors, we'd ask that they come forward. I have. That's the first I've heard that. So, if there's neighbors or somebody out there that has some information, we would ask them to come forward to us. Uh, that's the first time I've heard that. From here, we have talked to several neighbors and people that are involved in this. Are any other folks in the family under suspicion to have done this? You know, at this time, I don't want to go into details of suspicion and stuff because we're still early on. There's several questions that we need to get answered before we have a clear definition of what occurred in here. Who called 911 to report this? Uh, the, we had a party call 911. I don't want to go into that details at this time. So, Commander, do you have anybody under arrest? This time we do not have anybody under arrest. We're not actively out there looking for anybody. I would ask if there are neighbors or people that have information about this to please reach out and contact us. How long do you anticipate being on scene here today and this evening? I'm sure we are going to be processing through the evening on this. Uh, like I said, the office medical examiner just showed up. They need to do what they need to do, and then we'll have some processing after that. Commander, you've been doing this job for a very long time, so you have probably seen it all. How I'd, is this one for you? I, I don't want to say I've seen it all. Any time you have kids involved, it's a horrific event. So, uh, it's, I mean, it, it plays on the heartstrings of everybody that's involved. I wish, you know, I was at the point that I could tell you, you know, with more confidence, more information. But we're close, and when we get there, we'll let you know. Do you expect any other updates today? I don't know what they plan on. If, if, if something comes to the point we can update, we will definitely reach out and let you know. Okay. Thank you. Anybody else? Mm -hmm. Thank you.